my name's Starla. I'm from Texas and my daughter's Bobby Jo and she's a pageant queen. She's won every pageant she's been in since she's six months old. Hi, my name's Bobby Jo. I'm six years old and I'm in pageants. Woo! <laughs> yeah, I love pageants, but my mama, you know, like some people say the way she puts me in pageants is unethical, but I never heard that word before because I'm six years old. I assume it means a type of corn oil, but my mama only eats gravy, so I don't know where that's from. Uh, hello. My name is uh, Sal. I'm Billy Joe's coach, and you know, I think she's got real potential. Uh, you know, she's won a bunch of pageants, and I've won about 300 pageants, and you know, I only sabotaged about, you know, 290 of them, so that's like half. Um, so, you know, I'm really, uh, I'm really looking forward to working with them again this year, you know, uh, Billy Joe, and, you know, and uh, of course I get to see her uh, lovely mother, uh, Sterla, so I think it's going to be a, another great year bringing a lot of uh, medals and trophies and you know keeping keeping her out of school you know that's that's a big thing well, thank you ready to see my routine I'm ready to Just see do it, it Joe. stop wasting my time Jesus oh my god did you swallow a bowling ball lord you are fat chubby <laughs> My wow, God. those teeth are crooked. Um, <laughs> Baba Joe, do it again. Come on, your knees are buckling. Don't buckle your knees. Lord, give me strength. This child is testing me. Lord will give you strength. At this time, I don't think so. Don't buckle your knees. Come on now. My oh my god, how many times do I gotta tell you? Do not buckle your knees! I'm sorry! Get out of my office no. right now, you too, Starla! And I want your weekly coupon! I don't coupon. need you! Come on, Bobby Joe! Um, you know, I was, I kept telling Billy Joe or Bobby Joe or whatever her name is that, you know, she can't be buckling her knees. You know, I said, if, if you don't, you know, unbuckle your knees, then we're going to have a problem. And that problem means that I'm going to have to sabotage all the other, you know, all the other contestants. Sir, I don't really think you can say this. What? Say what? That yeah. I'm going to break their knees before they go on well, Yeah, that, sir. I'm not really sure you could say that. Fine. Then, uh, then, then just cut that out, you know? I mean... I won't say it anymore. I'll just do it the day, you know, that it comes there. The, the day comes, you know? You know, but anyway, you know, I did, I did lose my temper a little bit. You know, I, if, if they're willing to come back, I'll take them back. But as of right now, uh, I gotta go buy me a new sledgehammer. You know, I was real upset with a coach today, but it's just cause he and I have a very special relationship. And by special, I mean, I don't pay him in monetary value. But instead, I exchange it for, you know, my livelihood. I'm a coupon, coupon and queen. And, you know, instead of money, I give them, you know, coupons for favors, brisket, whatever he'd like. And I, I hope we can go back to him and he don't get jealous of, you know, Bobby Joe, Because she may be a little more attractive than I am. But uh, overall, we'll work it out. <laughs> Um, this is my special drink, and I drank it before all of my, um, pageants, my glitz pageants, and, um, it really, I don't know what it is, but it just, like, it makes me feel so good and feel crazy, and I just can't perform without it. So, um, what exactly is in your special juice? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Well, I will tell you this. My late husband, Lord bless his soul, he was a very hard working man and he left me the distillery when we were, you know, when he passed. So I, you know, 
Bob and Joe has a little bit of a taste and I, I let her have some in her special juice and she loves it. It really helps her with the competition. Are you sure? That just kind of looks like vinegar. Well, it ain't. It's certainly something more than vinegar because vinegar can't get you that hyper that quick and vinegar is probably toxic chemicals of some sort. I don't really know. Alright, Bobby Joe, it's dinner time. Now, I brought you your favorite. Look how much you have to eat tonight, sweetie. You better eat it all. Aww. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> I can't cut it. Well, pick it up with your damn hands, man. more competitions than she'd ever even participated in. You know, I was on top. I was the best. Um, pageantry was and still is my life and that's why Bobby Jo doesn't have, you know, any sort of say in whether or not she does a competition because pageantry, I got, you know, you know, a tragedy happened. I got disqualified when I was 32 years old of age. You know, I was still young. I had about 70 to 100 more competitions in me, you know. They have uh, aged contestants and I was just so mad because I got disqualified because someone found out that me and Coach Sal were, you know, sabotage in the competition so they kicked me out and that was the last time I was in a glitz you know pageant so this year if Billy Joe don't win man she ain't gonna she won't be able to walk straight for a couple days you know I'm I mean couponing does not reduce any of the aggression in my body the only way I could get it out was through pageantry Honey, it's the best part of the day. Time to get your spray tan. Okay, Mom, I'm ready. All right, here goes your leg. Oh, Mom, it's cold. Yeah, so it was the Arctic Sea when the Titanic sunk, but they didn't complain now, did they? All right, here comes the back of your legs. Oh, you were looking tan. Let me get that face of yours. Can't be pasty. That's disgusting. Does it look good, Mama? It looks great, sweetie. The judges won't tell. It's 100% natural. Now, a lot of people have a problem with tanning, but personally, I don't see the problem. You see, I have been tanning Baba Jo since she was about one and a half years old. Now, that's good. In the pageant world, they start when they're six months old and go until they're about 52. Now, many people think that, you know, tanning may cause cancer or some weird skin problems, maybe aging. Well, honey, they haven't been to Texas. God wouldn't have put tan beds on this here earth to kill people. But unless they want to look good. That's what that's what God made them for. So I'm just making Baba Joe look even be more beautiful. And for myself, do I look my age? I'm now, you probably think I'm around 27. I understand. It's the tanning. I'm actually around, well, I can't tell you that. Now 
hold still. Let me do your hair. Uh, Mama, it hurts. I don't care. Don't care. Don't I, I won't buckle my knees, I swear. Buckle your knees and I'm going to get upstage and I'm going to break your legs too. <laughs> Coach, you yeah. gonna make my makeup ruin. Now, Bobby, yeah, just because I look better than you, it does not mean I'm trying to upstage you. We have a reputation to need to hold. So you better suck it in. I can only do so much with this body of yours. Now win or... Right, go out there and win. Yeah, yeah. And win. Come on to Coach side. Come on now. Okay. Go ahead, win. I paid good money for this. Now time for our final contestant, Bobby Joe. Yeah, Bobby, that's my girl! Come on. Knees. Knees. This year's glitz pageant is Bobby Jean. 